This is in the 60s. And A month. Basically, so, and he also fixed those machines as an engineer and he also worked in the mine. Well, the oil shale is, as a natural resource, has been uh, created uh, actually a long, long time ago. So we could say that when the first life uh, how do you say, it evolved, so the oil shale. Ja see on see põlepi selline väärkus. Teda maailmas allist musta nii, pruunis peal kunaka nii väike. Need, need on meie omandus kõige kaunis pruuni toon. See on meie põlepi. Well, this is Estonian oil shale. So, uh, it depends where it's been created and which area and what kind of like a... Mis ta pruunis teeb? On, on see meie liib ja meie... Ei, ei. ei Temas on uh, parmasi kõpi ainata. Seventy percent of it, it it has oil, and what he was explaining that there is there is like a thirty percent of organic. Well, he's talking about um, about the oil shale. How we have oil shell and Estonia, but why Finns do not have it? It's everything because of the ice time. Uh, in Finland, so here are like different surfaces. This is the oil shell, and then here must be the granite, right? And in Finland, they do have granite, but we were lucky that the during the ice time, the water didn't like uh, washed it off. Mm -hmm. And the other thing is the water has been like a pushing it further and further. That's why we don't have on the coast as much, but further in inland. Okay. Yeah. Here you can see how it's going uh, underground. Going the down. train, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. So both underground and above ground. Yeah. Nineteen. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And usually three men work together. Yeah. It's made in 1933 when the Germans and they took it over because they had their own interest to produce a uh, gasoline or heating oil, whatever, for the uh, submarine eight engines. At, uh, since everything was close to the surface, they didn't need any uh, special kind of technique to dig it and mm -hmm. to work on it. So they had just, I don't know how to name this kind of like a- Excavation? A, yeah, axes and they were digging it out uh. and they were it was like a handwork. Like here, you can look at the picture what they did. Mm -hmm. So this is what they did. So. 
And they had a horse. Kirkat. Yeah, they had a horse. Mm -hmm. Yksi puupoistoe. This is mm -hmm. what year was that? Parpiit um, lantikesin. In the early 20s? See on siis uh, 20-30-tel 30-tel. See algas kohtla nõmmel 36-tel aastal. Uh, it, this picture is actually from 1936. 1936. So, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Ja osa jäiki maa peale tööd, tekis karjääri menet. Mm -hmm. Teised mm -hmm. läksid maa alla. And uh, some people, they divide their work too, that who like more to go underground. underground. Mm -hmm. They work underground and the other people, they... Sellist väikesed kagunid oli kuhu laetki põlevkivi. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Selline masin on iigla võimas, ta pikkus on pigemale 10 meetri. It's... Kopa suurus on 7 kuu, 7 tonni lõstab ta kopa. Right. Nii masinad töötavad maa alla praegu. Yeah, these machines are working right now nowadays mm. on the ground and they're extremely huge. Mm -hmm. So they can uh, dig up with one time to like seven tons. Yeah. So they they're gonna have they're gonna use like metal, so metal peelers mm -hmm. to support it. And so there are like several metal peelers and the gap between is seven meters so so that you could dig with that um Lanterns. Yeah. 